Welcome back, one and all, to the Mega Man Bound Network 3 Let's Play. Last time we left off, we went to school at night, discovered a weirdo who looked for something called the Tetra Code. And, well, he ties all of our friends, and now we gotta break into the school system and bust them out. So basically, this is like a flashback to the. It's kind of like a. Like, basically, this is kind of a giant mega flashback to those of you who have been following since the first part. Like, when we did Mega Man Battle Network 1 last year. And, yeah, this is kind of a major flashback to that, because I mean, this is the exact same asset she used in Battle Network 1! I won't hold them against them using the same access, but it's kind of noticeable. Didn't get the counter on that one. The security door is closed. You must unlock the security door to pass to the area beyond it. Key data is needed to open the security door. The key data should be around here, but it's too dark now. I agree. Oh, but you have to find a key data in the dark. Can you do something about it, Lamb? Okay, let me figure out some way to make your area brighter. Hold on, program is saying something. In order to make the area brighter, you'll have to turn on the light switch in the real world. By the way, I saw a doodle on the other day. I saw a doodle the other day. It said, Cleaners 1. Perhaps that has something to do with the real world. Cleaners 1. Is it a clue for the real world for this area? Cleaners 1. The janitorial room? How's it, Mega Man? It's still too dark in here. Guess that wasn't it then. Okay, so it wasn't there. Okay, I can't get to the storage room. That's the exit out of the school. Can't get by those boxes. Okay, so I'm at the classroom. Why is it called cleaners? It's just stuff. This is a kind of interesting, I'll just call it mechanic, for this level. Where basically you have to rely on a flashing light to find data. Oh, I got a red power up. I have one more megabyte. I need, I need eight. Game, give me uh, just give me what I needed. I just need one. One of those. I have the perfect setup for a Tetra. For a triple delete. There you are. Ah yeah, that's the stuff. Only two hundred zenny. Rip off. That's data B, that's data C, data B, A then. I didn't even mean to do that, but I'll take it. Shockwave D! Okay, so it was a virus. Double delete with a counter on the side. Well, drag it up. So that was a trap. B! <laughs> Maybe I say the whole thing's gonna say the letter. Okay, what we got here? Nothing. Well, looks like lots of textbook programs for pets. I guess I want to keep the jump. So.
kind of probably have to go back and buy more physical chips. If only so that I can maximize my chances of getting invisible in every battle. Except it's using a one I've been using. the trap program. Okay, so let's hit one of those stupid things with it, like messed up and press the button. Okay, that worked. Recovery? Ooh, an unmarked recovery. That is a nice one. I'll slide that into the fold for later. Double counter! Give me that book rack game! There we go, that's the stuff. Okay, off to the races we go. Here you too. Emergency, emergency! An intruder has been entered through the security door. How can we open the door? It has three passwords, you must find them to open it. Unfortunately, it's too dark in here to look for them now. I will go turn on the lights. Leave it to me. Thanks, Lan. You know the cyber world you're in now? Hold on. I can see something that looks like a statue. A statue? Okay, I'll look around. Man, I did a terrible line already right there. I can start to assume that this would be like that in the classroom. It's not the next classroom. Statue. I don't know if this like the time. Okay, so I did equate to that thing, even though it's not the same design at all. Whatever. Okay, that's that's good Zinny. I'll take Zinny. Oh, I saw data there. No data up here. Oh, there's a statue. Password C! something more to take out the rabbits like I could do in a while. Little sweet. But yeah, that was cool enough. And I messed it up. I messed up. I thought I was going to jump closer to me, but I jumped away and I messed it up. There you go. Spread her feet! Data. And it's a trap program. Ooh, I need a sword. Now well, this will do. And now they're all dead. Okay, so what do we got? More bug crap, yes. Password B! We have A and B. We have B and C, not A. We don't have A at all. 
Zapping me. Like the boundaries. Okay. That's where I I got in reverse order. Neat. Starships go, these are probably some of the best ones in the games. At least the setups have been good. Okay, use the passwords. And there is Flashman, so let's do this real quick. Mega Man! Flashman, release my friends from the hypnosis! I told you, you have to delete me to break the hypnosis. Come and get me, Mega Man! Land! Mega Man Battle Routine set! Execute! Flash Man! Game's first boss! He is fast! Like, annoyingly fast! Not as fast as the not as fast as Flash as the Speed Man from last game, but his gimmick of having to hit him as when he's moving. But basically, he's very annoyingly fast because you know speed of light and makes him hard to hit because of it. So basically, my cannons are kind of worthless once I get him while he's attacking. But as you can see, back row, the back row. Effectively, his only weakness. Trying to save roll for the finishing blow. Gonna keep taking pot shots at him. Oh, there! That's uh. Forgot what that does, but only get hit by it. Nope, none of that now. Screw finishing blow, get him roll! Get 60 damage as always, and a love, and a loving. Come on, come on, come on, man, come on, come here! Haha, <laughs> last shot! No damage! Keep that, Flash Man! 
you disappointed me, Flash Man. I mean, that was kind of sad. He, I, he didn't hit me at all. I'm deeply sorry, sir. I hope you haven't forgotten the rules of our organization. Yes, sir. Rule 98. Never get deleted, even if delete, even if deleted in battle. You will fight Lan and Mega Man again. Go, Flash Man! Yes, sir! Mega Man, Lan, enjoy your last flash! A flash of death! Shining Browser Crash! Dear God, I love that name. <laughs> well done, Flash Man. That flash is the beacon of a major catastrophe. And with that, young lad, I'll take my leave. Farewell. Wait, just who are you? He's gone, Lan. Ugh. Mega Man, are you okay? I'm okay, just a little dizzy. But how is everyone? If ever, is everything okay? Well, that's right. We gotta, we gotta get over there. Has the hypnosis worn off? We were hypnotized? I had absolutely no idea. You saved us again, Lan. Thanks. No problem. We should go home or we'll be late for school tomorrow. I can't be late. Let's head back home. You're right, and I need my beauty sleep, too. See you tomorrow. I like how you just casually get over this. By the way, Lan, what did, what did that guy mean by major catastrophe? You're thinking too you're thinking too much, Mega Man, don't sweat it. We should go home too. I'm not giving it back, Melu. I can't sleep and I'm in the park now in the net battle. Oh and thanks for today. Take this as thank you for me. Got the dex code. I mean I got a few more minutes. I don't want to end the episode just yet. Let's do this thing. First battle with decks of the game. An eternal rival, Gutsman. Up there. Get him, roll. Oh, there. I didn't expect him to kill him. Thank you, roll. <laughs> Gutsman G. I'll get. I'll get you next time. That was a nice, quick little bout. You are late now. Go to bed. You don't want to be late for school tomorrow. So with that, I'll see you all next time. Let's hit the hay, Mega Man. And with that, goodbye all. See you next time.